We often associate alcohol with having a good time and feeling positive, but unfortunately, it doesn't always work that way. Alcohol can have an effect on your mental health, whether you're feeling stressed at the end of the day and having a drink to relax, or whether you're struggling with diagnosed depression. Reducing how much you drink is a really simple way of helping your mental health and reducing the risk of long-term harms. Now, alcohol may have a very temporary positive effect on your mood, but in the long term, it can contribute to feelings of depression and anxiety, as well as making stress harder to deal with. That's because alcohol is a depressant. Drinking alcohol can make you feel more anxious, or if you're already anxious, it can make those feelings worse. You can get into a vicious cycle. You drink because in the very short term it relieves your anxiety, but then again, it makes you feel more anxious in the long term. Same thing with depression. Heavy drinking, especially regular heavy drinking, is strongly linked with symptoms of depression, and it can be really hard to disentangle what's caused the depression, whether the alcohol's caused the depression, or whether the depression is causing you to drink. The Chief Medical Officer advises that in order to keep health risks from alcohol to a low level, both men and women shouldn't regularly drink more than 14 units a week. If you are regularly drinking as much as this, it's safest to spread your drinking evenly over three or more days. The risk of developing a range of health problems increases the more you drink on a regular basis. A good way to cut down the amount you drink is to have several drink-free days 